it's robbery. They like robbery. And then you feel like because you're bigger than one other artist, you have the right to. Nah, man. It's evil. And I think that the, the laws should be taken more serious with stuff like that. People coming through should understand. You know, their rights exist, their rights are to be respected. Uh, and the, the, the statutory institutions that are put in place to, to ease, to, to, to take care of, you know, the problems of licensing, of, you know, copyright transfer and administration and collective management. So once, once you know, we, we have all that in place and, and well, well, well uh, established, it, it will reduce, you know, uh, the incidence of copyright infringement to a, you know, to a significant level. I think we should start by letting people get aware. Let, we should let them know this is what you can gain. This is your right. This is what belongs to you. Then when, then when you know that, then people should be careful when they are signing any contract. You should review those contracts with your lawyers. Don't just sign in another thing. That's, I think it's everything that boils down to the... You need to, you need to be aware. You need to know. When you are conscious of what it what is going on, when you are well informed, you are well educated, then we have lists of that cases. It's actually are really affecting a lot of people because people put in a lot of works into their project. At the end of the day, they didn't get what they were supposed to get. The run are lost, and um, they they brought, some of them borrowed money to do a project, and they couldn't. They, at the end of the day, they couldn't pay. So it's really affecting, and it's not growing because people that are really have great content that they. Their content can take Nigeria to the very next level. Yeah. After they have been robbed, they get discouraged. They don't want to put in more works again. So the, in tones, the Nigerian music industry is not growing, it's not developing. The, it's actually a crime against humanity. And of course, this crime can never be uh, copped, except the government put in place an enabling law to actually prosecute and sentence the culprits to the law courts. That is the way forward. It doesn't allow the industry to grow. Uh, it actually stunts the development. And of course, uh, it's a crime, like I said. The earlier, the better for us to tackle it, the better for all of us, because everybody's losing. The content creators are losing the artists are losing, the media are losing, and even the government itself is losing. So it affects every sector of the, of the economy. It's wrong. Yeah, um, you see, everybody should respect their, their territories, you know. Um, people don't know that most of the songs that are out there are actually written by other people and some of them buy it. So if in my case I want to buy a song, I buy it outright so you don't come tomorrow to tell me, oh, you want to write to something, so the pressure on every artist to make a hit is is high. So some of them just go out there and they are looking for songs by any means, you know. You know another fun, the funny thing is, if I take a line that is sweet from your song, I can use it to create something else. I don't really, I don't really believe in artists taking another artist's content or whatever because uh, number one, an artist might decide to to have a content for himself. Maybe he called his own Romeo. And the other one might, might have another concept too that is called Romeo. So it doesn't really mean that because you, you call your own uh, content Romeo, and I eventually came up with another concept that is titled Romeo as well, doesn't really mean that, <laughs> that doesn't mean that it's your, it's your content. But in some situation, an artist maybe utilize his, <laughs> his partner or his colleague content. Truly, it happens. But when it happens like that, um, my own advice or my own uh, contribution to that is for such artists, before using such content, should at least take permission or something like approval. <laughs>